Welcome back, folks. We are continuing on right where we left off, and we actually have an order that we can deliver, which gives us three new humans, plus three to human resolve, and two uh, parts, which is really nice. So deliver that. Uh, we want you not to do crops anymore, but do these. Uh, you can make them out of eggs, I guess. Yeah, make them out of eggs. Uh, you are doing that. Uh, we have a couple more humans. Alright, you're making flour now, which is good. Uh, let's set up another farm. Uh, let's set up a farm here. Uh, food production, farm field, well, we need farm fields, uh, food production, small farm, like so, what do we get here, herb garden, beautiful, you're picking the herb garden, and we're going to set up a uh, herb garden, uh, where can we reach everything here, right there, and we're going to build some paths. Uh, okay. We're going to build a path up over here. We're going to get some farm fields in here. And we're going to put this on priority one. Okay. Well, we get some new settlers. Let's get three and two, I think. And well, we get a new cornerstone, ten eggs per minute. Uh, 10 eggs per minute is really nice. That really helps our food situation. You are making jerky. Uh, we can put a lizard in here. And you... can move down here and do that. Uh, I actually don't think we need so we have two lizards in here. Now we could put another lizard in here for the meat production. Which I think would be good. We are making biscuits. We are making jerky. Um, I'm not sure that we need to actually have a human in there. It is drizzle, so they can start planting. And we have two humans in there. I thought that there was one of our camps that only had one uh, thing in it. But I guess not. Uh, oh, you do. Right, well, we'll put the a human in there. Uh, we discovered this. Ooh, what did we get? Speller. Uh, what did you make? Wine, pickled goods, and barrels. Okay. A clothier. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Uh, rebuild. Investigate. A tea doctor. Leisure and luxury. All right, the clothier is really nice. Uh, let's get a path going up to that. We'll come up this way, go in that way. And come in there. 
So we'll put a path there. And we are restoring the clover there. That is going to be so good. You're making uh, biscuits. You're making uh, jerky. This is great. This is really, really great. Uh, I think I want another uh, trapper's camp. Uh, trapper's camp. Uh, because we have... We had some stuff somewhere else that we could grab with the trapper's camp, didn't we? I guess not. Uh, that's the stone cutters camp. Where's our scavengers camp? Our scavengers camp is up here. Okay, so there we have one. Okay. Yeah, so another uh, trapper's camp is fine. We can get a new building. Library. Uh, luxury free religion and education a human house or a lizard house uh, our humans are fine so let's get a human working in here we just want you to make uh, clothes and we'll set a limit of 50 I guess and we can deliver this Done, done. That gives us 10 more parts. 30 berries. And plus one to mushroom production. Not bad. Okay. Uh, I wanted to see this one. That gives leisure and luxury. This one gives religion, luxury, and education. Uh, we don't need a clothier. We don't really need a carpenter. We need a rain mill for the flower. That would be kind of good. Um, rain mill. Let's build it there. Uh, I want to build a storage over here. Okay. Uh, let's get some more glades opened up because we need to open up two more for another level. So move you. Over here, I guess. Make your way in there. You. Um. You come in here. And open up to in there. And that will give us our glades, which will be good. We get 0 0.25 reputation per minute now, so that's nice. Uh, let's see, we have... Let's put your priority up. All right, and we are still planting. All right, we should get a lot of stuff now. We have two packs of provisions. We're making another two, that's good.
And you have almost gotten everything that you need. Okay, we have more meat standing. Forager's camp would actually be kind of nice. You're opening up to in there. Our scavenger's camp is doing eggs up here. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Uh, do, yeah, we have homeless uh, housing shelter. Um, let's build a few houses here, I guess. Our humans are super happy. Our lizards are almost super happy. We have a little bit of clothing. You're making more. Uh, sword is on his way. Uh, do we want to restore? Uh, let's uh, put this house on priority one. Oh, we have our provisions. Deliver that. Okay, that means that we need another one on one. And you can start making provisions. Uh, you can actually come out because we don't need any more packs of provisions, but we do need packs of building materials. So get back in there, make me building materials. Uh, how many did we need? 30. Do we really want to do that? I'm not sure. Furnace, smelter, or human house. I guess we'll go with the uh, smelter. All right, we made it through here. There's another huge slick shell brood mother. Nice. And that means that we did this one. So. Plus three to global with solve, 15 amber and 35 pottery. Nice. Um, let's rebuild this, the tea doctor, so that we can get some luxury. Who wants luxury? You do, the beavers, okay. Uh, you want brotherhood or religion. You want religion or leisure, okay. Alright, we are getting our houses built, which is great. So we will have no homeless when we hit the storm. And now our lizards are super happy as well. Not anymore, but they were. Uh, we're getting more clothes. Uh, let's stick another human in here making clothes. Because we kind of need more clothes. All right, we get the next thing, granary, pack of crops, pack of provisions, pack or and mush soup. We already have a clothe there, so let's just pick that. I don't actually think that we need anything. And why are you not being built?
we have some incense. Uh, we don't actually need anyone in there, I don't think. Cornerstone. Each newcomer group has two additional villagers. That's not bad. Urban group production is increased by plus one for every 50 biscuits produced. Five plant fiber per minute. Uh, let's do five plant fiber per minute. The trader is here. A brewery. We don't have a tavern, so... Um... Let's see, what do we have a lot of? Well, we have some packs of provisions, which we don't need. And we have some packs of crops, which we don't need. Um... Let's get some of these. It's not a lot that we can get for that. But we can add some eggs. Let's add like 40 eggs. And we can get 16. Okay. Great. Plus one to her production. All right. All right, it's drizzle time, so everyone is planting. That's good. We have so clothes right now. Uh, we can get some people. Let's take a look at that. Um... One, two, two, or three, two. Let's do one, two, two. That means that we need another shelter. That is being built. Uh, we can get someone working in here, I guess. Uh, a beaver, yeah. human, sure. Um, all right, the houses are going up. We really need planks, dude. Uh, let's get another beaver in here. All right, our shelters are up. Um, this really doesn't need to be way over there. Man, we've almost won. I want to open up to in there and see. Alright, 0.27 per minute, but both of these guys are almost there. Okay, we have our uh, rain mill now, which can produce flour. So let's tell you to not produce flour anymore. I'm going to set this to 50 instead. Alright, our lizards are happy as well. So now it's 0.45 per minute. So we are, we basically won. We basically won. Yeah, everyone is happy. Everyone is super happy. All right, what do we have? Uh, petrified tree. It's strange. 
tree turned into stone by the rain. It's radiating sickness to the other trees around it. Uh, first of all, a tree is radiating its sickness onto the entire forest. Tree cutting is, is what? Tree cutting in woodcutters camp slower. Uh, that sentence doesn't make sense the way they wrote it. Uh, it should be tree cutting in woodcutters camps slower or tree cutting is slower in the woodcutters camp. Uh, the petrified tree seems to affect the villagers as well. Villager movement speed is decreased by 25%. It's not good. Investigate that, please. So that wasn't actually too dangerous, really. Everyone is happy we, we basically won, so we might as well just deliver this. And that wins it for us. Nice! All right, uh, discover two dice with death one. What's that? 25 food. Outstanding. So, Apollos. And now we can get this. Yes! That is definitely what we're doing. 30 food and 5. But first, Smoldering City. Let's check out our deeds. Uh, what's this? Win a game with 200 paths built. Need to get that. Uh, win a game with one dangerous glade event standing. Okay. Cool, cool. And discover to discover 80 glades. That's nice. Oh, and that takes us to level 7. Fantastic. That was all we did, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So we need to build a lot of paths. Because then we're out of phase of the moth, I guess. Uh, we have a lot of trade routes. Uh, what upgrades can we get? Uh, Apothecary can produce tea inserts and biscuits and the tea doctor. That's pretty nice. I wouldn't mind that. Uh, leather glove, cornerstone, and the ranch. I wouldn't mind that either. Plus one trade route. I think that this is what we're going for. An extra trade route and then the mist piercers thing. That could be pretty interesting. Unlock that. And now, what are these things up here? Beaver house, human house, and lizard house are essential buildings, which means we have them from the start. Oh man, oh man. I want that. A plantation building blueprint can produce berries, plant fiber. And the grove can produce berries, crystallize dew. Okay. A plus one embark point uh, and the black market gain two additional trade route slots but impatient grows 30 percent faster ouch uh, the cornerstone five wine and the building improvement for the seller okay moldy grain seeds a new type of grain gain five mushrooms for every 10 grain reduced that's not bad uh, and the greenhouse reduces mushrooms and Herbs at two stars. Uh, okay, regardless of the season. And then rebellious spirit. But people feel oddly rebellious. Gain plus one global solve for every plus one patience or impatience. Okay. Exploring expedition constantly. You took some of the best explorers from this uh, smoldering city with you. Gain a constant minus five to global resolve but plus 15 to global resolve for three minutes every time a new glade is discovered. So we need to, basically you need to discover glades all the time then. Okay. Well, I think we'll call this one here and next time we will head out to uh, over here where we will get five of the machinery things. 
So yeah, thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.